Did you know you could test your hearing for free? So you don't have to guess anymore and wonder, have I suffered from any hearing loss? You can find out. Just download an app from the App Store or Google Play. The first one I'll tell you about is from the World Health Organization, and it's called Hear Who, W-H-O. This test takes about five minutes, and you need to wear headphones or the app won't run. During the test, you'll be presented with 23 sets of numbers. You'll hear a continuous background of static noise, and a human voice will recite three numbers in the background during each set. You won't be able to hear these numbers without the headphones. Then just type what you hear or what you think you hear. You only get one chance for each set of numbers, so you can't redo them. You'll get a score when you're done. A score of 75 or above means you have pretty good hearing. Between 50 and 75 might be considered okay, but you should regularly check your hearing to make sure your score doesn't get any lower. I personally got a score of 73. A score of 50 or below indicates some hearing loss, and you might want to see a specialist for a professional hearing assessment. If you'd like to try another hearing test, you can download an app called Mimi, M-I-M-I. This app plays a series of tones with different loudnesses and different frequencies. So sometimes the tone is very high or very low, or you can barely hear it. You should press the button when you hear a new tone and release it when you stop hearing it. Just like with the Hear Who app, you need to wear headphones. The Mimi app will test your left ear separately from your right ear, and it gives you results for both ears and lets you know if you've got any hearing loss. I just had a little bit of hearing loss, as you can see here. With these apps, you can get some feedback at no cost to find out the status of your hearing. And again, if your results show that you've got hearing loss, you should see a specialist. And don't forget to protect your hearing when you're in a loud environment. We've got another video about using earplugs, and they're easy and affordable, and you should bring them with you when you go to loud music events. Thanks for watching. To get more information about noise and acoustics, or to hear interviews with experts, visit soundproofist.com. Shadows.